I think um, the thing that has always um, really obsessed me about writing and writers is I think that we have a secret and um, if we're able to communicate it in a, 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 a sort of code form almost of a story and then certain people will respond to it or not respond to it but um, this is uh, this is what makes us fall in love with certain writers. Like I mean, I'm in love with Scott Fitzgerald and and um, Catherine Mansfield, and um, there are so many. I don't know. It's like they they reveal something to you about yourself, which is what the secret is. I just kind of always wanted to, um, I always wanted to write and I always wanted to paint. I also was an actress for seven years, which uh, was interesting. And um, then, you know, you kind of focus your life so you channel it into the kind of one thing and now I, uh, when I'm painting, I don't write, and when I'm writing, I don't paint. My first story was published in Ontario Review, actually the last issue, and I used a, a, a pseudonym, uh, Mary Marsh, um, and I really don't quite know why I did that, <laughs> except that um, it was sort of about somebody I was involved with, and I think I felt kind of guilty, you know, if my name was on it. <sighs> Which is ridiculous, you know. Because there's nothing mean about it, there's nothing, but it was just very personal, you know. And, um, so, um, Ray, in, in the, you know, they do these little, these little bio things in, in the back, and, he said, Mary Marsh, this is her, is a, is a designer and, and an artist, and this is her first published story. <laughs> so then I, I, I was really angry at myself because it's a good story, and I'm really angry that my name isn't on it, you know. So anyway, that was the first published story. And, um, but I learned my lesson, and from then on, my name is, is on 